Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel called Fashion Aficionado. My name is Abib, here I talk about lifestyle, fragrances, fashion. If this is your first time here, please go ahead, like, share, subscribe. In the description box, so I can get notified anytime I upload new content. So today I'm going to be talking about how to smell good for a cheap. So that means if you like like very expensive perfumes, you might want to try this fragrance out. This is not a sponsored video, I'm just putting it out there. You might want to try out this fragrance brand, this fragrance brand, because they actually do very nice clones of fragrances. So, and fragrance house, house I'm talking about is Alexandra fragrances. So they make clones of high-end perfumes. They also have their own fragrances too that they made, their original make um, brand or original creations. But these are clones of very expensive perfumes they've made, and. Um, yeah, this ones they smell good. They last some of them last longer than the original. Yeah. They smell some are like ninety percent close, some are like eighty percent close. Yeah. If I'm gonna be spending like divided by ten of the price. Yeah. I think I'll take that. <laughs> so uh, without further ado, let's get right into the list. So um I have five fragrances I'm gonna be talking about, but I have two honorable mentions. So the two honorable mentions are boardroom and game time so boardroom is a clone of jeremy fragrances office for men this is in broxin bulb like it's a citrus high citrus fragrance it's supposed to be a mass appealing fragrance but it's not my favorite in the alexandria collection so or the collection i got from alexandria it's nice too it's a good summer fragrance it's a safe office where you can even see from the name the name of the original or the inspiration is office for men and this is called boardroom mm. you can <laughs> you see where they're trying to go but yeah it's a good office fragrance you can wait to the office you can wait to any occasion because yeah it's just yeah it's a safe fragrance then the other one is game time so this game time is supposed to be a mixture of baccarat rouge and creed aventus yeah the two heavy bangers so if you're gonna get those two fragrances you're gonna be spending nothing less than 700 dollars yeah for the two and this here you can get a sample for <laughs> maybe i don't know maybe ten dollars or less so this is like a mixture of the two it's called game time but i get more of baccarat root oh, okay on the dry down you can still smell aventus in it yeah, it's nice because I spray it here earlier. Yeah, it's lovely, man. So those are my two honorable mentions. So now I'm getting into the main list. So the first one here is a clone of Nishane Honey. And this one is called Honey. So they added H to it. The one of the one Nishane has doesn't have doesn't have H in front. And funny enough, the I think the founder of this company's name is honey the one with with the h that's his name too so just a coincidence but it smells close to honey and it's if you love vanilla oh my god this is a nice vanilla fragrance if you're looking for a date night scent you might want to sample this try out the sample it's, it's sweet it's inviting it's yeah it's gourmandy a bit too because it's as it's edible feel to it but it's nice this so this is a clone of nishane annie this is annie from alexandria house so moving up to number three this is a clone of killian's black phantom this is dark knight so you can see black phantom dark knight so they replace the black with dark and they replace the phantom with <laughs> night <nice. laughs> yeah so yeah this is it has coffee, it has cacao or cocoa or yeah, chocolate ingredients, yeah. So sweet, it's lovely for fall, winter, oh my god. Mm. Yeah, my fiance loves this. This is her favorite. Yeah, this is nice, man. Sweet is, uh, it's, yeah, <laughs> it's lovely. That's all I can say about it. Yeah, then moving on to the next one. This is from the. This is a clone of Bondomanize 
Bleecker Street. So do I need to go into explanation of Blum? Bond number nine is a New York fragrance line. They name most of their fragrances on things peculiar to New York. Like Bleecker Street is a street in New York. There's Lafayette Street, that's a street in New York too. There's Chinatown, there's Chinatown in New York. So just yeah. So this is a clone of Bleecker Street. So Alexandra named it Emerald Street. So if you want to get a feel of what this smells a bit like, not exactly, like the same kind of vein. Like um, Creed's um, Green Irish Street, that kind of like that green spring kind of fragrance. Yeah, I think it's because of the violet leaf. Because this has violet leaf too. This has violet leaf, it has, I think, black currant. I love this fragrance. <laughs> like I've, I've worn it a bit. So yeah, this is yeah, Emerald Street. You can't go wrong with this. Too. In summer, spring, this is lovely. Man. Yeah, then my number one. This is a clone of um, MFK. That's Mr. Francis Corrections Gentiflerity Silver. So this is called Retro Flare Silver. So they. So they have silver today. You kind of know it's a clone of that. So this has, I think it has musk. It has juniper berry. <sighs> this this too has that cooling effect to it. Like if you're looking for a good summer fragrance. And I think last time I was it last time I did. Uh, no, it wasn't last time I traveled. But last time I went to Texas, I was at the Galleria in Texas. I went to was it not strong? and smelled the original as gentle fluidity silver the original that this was or this is an inspiration of it smells very close to it like very very close to it and funny enough i kind of i prefer this to even back at rouge and the mfk line i prefer this to wood mood is it wood mood no sorry wood satin mood yeah this is my the gentle fluidity silver is my favorite mfk fragrance yeah this it's a lovely fragrance. Summer, spring, fall. I don't know. This is just cool. It has this refreshing feel to it. Yeah. So I've come to the end of this video. Yeah, you guys can go to their website, check out. They have lots of fragrances, lots of inspirations, and lots of their original creations too. So check out if you have a favorite fragrance, or if you have a fragrance you like, but it's very expensive. You can try check their website and see if you can get their clones in and you can read the reviews too. Um, yeah, I had to do a lot of research before gathering these ones, but I've, I've had these fragrances for about a year now. So I wanted to use them for a while before actually reviewing. So yeah, that's exactly what I did. So let me know if you guys have actually tried out their fragrances before, if you're gonna try them out. Yeah, put, it down in the put them in the comment section below then. If you have any suggestions of any other videos you want me to make just yeah yes go ahead comment and share please like i'm out of here thank you peace